I want to introduce to you Reza. Reza is one of our staff serving the Lord day and night with passion for the lost soul, for those who are suffering, giving him counsel, sharing the gospel with them. But he wasn't always that way. He was born as a Muslim. He was a devout Muslim in Iran. And when he grew up, he said, I started a business and the business went broke and I started cursing God. I said, it was your fault. And when I cursed God, I had a bad accident. I was hurt in that accident. My back was crooked. I couldn't move my hand. And my friends and family members would tell me, because you cursed God, Allah, he did that to you. You see, that's Islamic theology. A few weeks later, he said, at work, they showed me the video of a young woman being stoned to death. When I looked at it, I was so disgusted. I said, I do not believe in Islam, in God of Islam, in any God. God is so cruel. He orders, the God of Islam is so cruel. He is violent and he asks others to kill and stone other people. I don't believe that. Soon after, he said, one night I was watching television. I saw a Christian television and, and a pastor just said, without knowing me, he said, your name is Reza. You just had an accident. You have back problem and you have shoulder problem. And Jesus wants to heal your heart first, then your body. When I heard that, a hope came in, a light came into my life. I felt Jesus is healing my heart. And I just started dancing. There was a worship song on television. I started dancing, dancing. And my wife said, hey, Reza, look, you're moving your hand, your back, your crooked back is straight. And I said, oh, yes, Jesus healed my heart. And Jesus has healed my body. Soon after he contacted us, we trained him. And he said, later, I want to serve the Lord. You know what we gave him? What duty we gave him? We asked him to distribute Bibles, to smuggle and distribute Bibles illegally. And he did that for many years. At one time, his friends were arrested and he had to flee Iran. When he came to Turkey, we helped him to come to U.S. Now he is serving with us. And many, many people have come to Christ through him. And many have been healed because he prays for the sick. You know, Jesus says you have freely received and you freely give. And when I asked him, he said, Jesus has healed me. Jesus has saved me. Now I want to do the same for others. And I believe the same heart is in your heart. God has saved you. God has blessed you. Now you want to be a blessing to other people. You have freely received and you have want to freely give. Let me share something with you. When you support Reza, when you support Iran Alive, you know what you're doing? You're partnering with us and you're helping us to serve people on your behalf. You are serving through us. You're going to people's homes in Iran and the Middle East and sharing the gospel. I want to thank you. Thank you for partnering with us, standing with us, and allowing us to serve the Lord on your behalf.